Hello and welcome back to another video of Python 2020. Today from this video I am starting Selenium with Java series. In this series I will make 5 different videos. In the first video we will see how to set up Selenium and Chrome driver extension in Java Eclipse. Also we will see how to perform basic tasks like how to click and how to type data in web page. Then in the next video, we will see how to type data from Excel to web page. Suppose we have uh, 100 student data like name, uh, like name, email ID, uh, date of birth, etc. So how to fill this 100 student data in web page? This topic we will cover in the second video. In the third video, we will see how to handle web table, like how to loop on table, how to get data from range and from column and cell also. So this topic we will cover in the third video. In fourth video, we will see how to save screenshot and how to save file, like it can be PDF or Excel and CSV also. Then in the last video, we will see how to send email with all attachment files like a screenshot and PDF or CSV. These five topics we will cover in the, this series. So this is my first video in this series. So in this video, we will see how to set up Selenium and Chrome driver extension in the Java Eclipse. Before go ahead, please request to you. If you like the content of this video, so please hit the like button and subscribe my channel for more video. First of all, first of all, we open Eclipse. Wait a little time. Now you can see our Eclipse is open and now. Our first step is download Selenium. Then we will uh, download Chrome driver. Okay. So let's go on Chrome. Type Selenium download. Download. Go on first link. Down here you can see Java. So we will download this version 4.23. Click on this. Now you can see downloading is starting. Our second step is download Chrome driver. So before download Chrome driver, we have to check the Chrome driver version. Okay. Go to help on our Google Chrome. Now you can see. In my system, version is uh, 127. Okay. You will go on this link. This link I will mention in the description also. Now go on version section. Down. And the Chrome testing. Click here. Stable. Now you can see the where you can see Chrome driver. So you go on Chrome driver. Here I will download Win32. If you want uh, Win64, also you can download. Both are same. Okay. Now you can see the version of uh, Chrome. Okay. Like this. You can see downloading is starting. Okay, let's see. So it's downloaded. Okay, now you can extract. I have already downloaded Chrome driver and Selenium. So here, uh, Java Eclipse, and now here I'm creating a new 
uh, Java project. Now Java project. Now you can see our project is created. Now you can see we have one source uh, folder. Click on this, right click on this uh, folder, source, source folder, and create new package. First, we will create new package. Okay. So this is the demo package. I am giving the name as a demo package. Click on finish. Now, first of all, we add all jar files, selenium jar files here. Right click on project and build path. And now, configure build path. Okay. Click on this. Here you can see. So, go on Java, build path, library, and class path. Okay. So, now you can see. One option is here, add external jars, click on this, where you extract all selenium jar files, go on that folder. This is my selenium jar file folder, control A, so all file is selected and now click on open and apply, no? apply and close. Okay, so here you can see this referenced library is added. Okay. Now go to the package and here I'm creating a new class. Okay, this is the first main class first. Main, main Okay. Now, now select public static void main. Okay. Now finish. Here you can see. This is our first class. Okay. Set up here. First, we set up the Chrome driver. Now, first step is write system dot set uh, properties. Here you can see set property, string key, and string values. Okay. So, you will select this. Now, here I am giving the name. First, you have to give the uh, double quotation and um, name. Give the name. The, the name. Web driver. Dot. Chrome. Here we have to give the location of our Chrome extension okay i told you i have already downloaded here you can see this is the upper chrome drive click and right click on this copy as path okay. now go on eclipse and paste here so here we have to remove extra quotation this one also we have to remove now, done when and colon. Colon and now, uh, like uh, right tab driver dot driver equal to new new Chrome driver. Okay, so right same. This driver and parentheses and this one. Now over this and now you can see the import web driver. You can see our web driver is import and now then you can see also we will move when over this uh, Chrome driver. This one this over will come and we have to import Chrome Driver. Okay, that is very easy. 
now you will open the browser okay here i'm giving the like a driver dot get okay here we have to give the our uh, url this url i'm using here now save and check our url is open or not okay Take little time. Now you can see it's open. Same link is not pages not open properly. Something very wrong, I think. Yeah, I think URL is uh, located. I think I have to use HTTP also. Now let's check. Now you can see the page is open successfully. Now here I show you how to click and enter some value. Okay. Right click on this, inspect, okay, again right click, this is the other, uh, X bar, copy, and this is the X bar, with control F, and here you can see, this is the other X bar, okay, so we will use this X bar. For that here I'm using like the element and now I'm giving the name so the name of this investment initial investment okay. now right driver dot find element by so here I'm using X path X path okay the position and paste the X path and semicolon over this web element or we have to import web element also this okay now I show you thing first we will uh, type this value here and click on calculate button in this field you can see here already one value is here so first we have to clear clear this value okay that i'm using space and initial so this is the other variable which and now dot clear okay and again initial and dot send key okay. so here i'm using as a raw value like uh, default value so ready here something Thousand okay. And okay. Click run as a job application. Now you can see Chrome is open. Page and now you can see the value. Value is time. Okay. So now second our second step is click on calculate button. Okay. So, 
inspect inspect yes export control f and control b here you can see this is the very big uh, x path so here i have to use little short so first you can see here input okay so first i'm using ed like input input and at the rate value equal to value value now you can see input so we will the input and value so you see our values copy this name calculate okay I think this is star. This with this star we have to use from starting. Now you can see we are getting calculate button. Okay. So what I do here you can see first star slash and input so this calculate button is uh, inside this input in attribute okay and value you can see we will use value calculate okay now we are getting so copy this now go to the right clips and here again we will uh, like example i'm using here driver dot uh, find element by export export you can see now dot click also I'm using here only dot click This is the very basic and simple steps. Again, I have to check. It is very fast uh, process. You can see type and calculate button also click. Okay. And this is the our very basic and simple steps. And you will see in my next video how to how to type all values from Excel to web page. Hope you enjoy the video. If you like the content of this video, so please hit the like button and subscribe my channel for more video. I will see you in the next video. Till then, happy learning.